All right, so it's Monday, January 23rd, around 2.10 the afternoon. We're back at Village Hall to file some FOIA requests. It's pouring rain, which really sucks, but we're gonna take a walk around the building and then figure out how we file FOIA requests. Onward and forward. Good. Oh, this is cute. I can't walk that way. Why not? Well, I, I don't have any business at the front desk at the moment. Well, just because you say something doesn't mean it's true. There's nothing that says I can't go back here. Just because you say that doesn't mean it's true. That doesn't mean it's true. You could you could say I have to jump through a hula hoop before excuse I could come in here. Me, excuse me, you, just, you have to go to the front the desk. desk. And there's a the reason we have There's no one at the front desk to help me. Well, I'm going to go get somebody at the front desk. So please go to the well, front desk. Well, I'm going to do what I need to do. You got to go back. 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 I'm not going in the office. You got to go back. I'm not You got to step back. You got to go to the front desk. You can't come no back. No one's here. at the front desk. Okay. Where does it say I can't come back? You have to go back. Please get out of my you face. You have to go back. Back up. You have to back up. Why are you getting in my face? There's somebody at the front desk. There's somebody at the front desk. Okay, well, I'm going to go to the front desk when I'm done doing what I have to do. You can't come back. It's not a private area. It doesn't say private. You can't come back here. That doesn't. I'm telling you now. I'm what, telling you who now. are you? I'm telling you. Who now. are you? I'm Superintendent Department of Buildings and Commissioner of Public Works. You have to get back. Call the, Please go to call the cops ass. again. Call the cops again. Yeah, For what? Call the cops again. Call the cops. If you don't, you have to step back. There's nothing that you says. Have to step just because you Listen, say you're scaring me, you're threatening I'm me. I'm not doing anything. I'm standing right here minding I'm my own you business. Step back and get out of you're my the space. one who came to me. You, you get away from me. You can't just walk around the office. I can walk. There's nothing that says I can't you're walk around here. Me, I'm the one that's. Telling you're not. You. My, you're not in charge Listen, of me. Go downstairs and get Roy. You're not in charge go, of me. Go down and get Roy. Please. I'm conducting business in this building. You this is a public building. I can walk around. The front area is public. This is not. This There's nothing not, that says that. Just because, just because yeah, you say you have to step back. You have to step back. Press it. Yeah, go ahead. Call, call. What are you guys? Do you guys are always out of control. What's going on here that you guys are not? This is a public building. You can't come back here. This is a public hallway. There's nothing that says I can't come back here. Step back. I don't need to do anything. Why are you hindering me from doing what I need well, to do? I'm walking going? down the hall. Where I'm just, yeah, where I'm walking going? around the building. Yeah, you can't walk around the building. Why not? Do it's a public to building. Do you administration and walk around their building? Yes, it's if I public, needed to. No, if I had business there, yes, I would. I have business here. Shouting. There's somebody at the front oh. who's there to help you. Well, I've made it this far so far. I want to go back here and walk no, around. You, you cannot. Can't. There's nothing that says you I can't. Just because you, 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 your word, your word means nothing. If you want to, if you want to push me out of the way, go for it. I'm not doing I'm anything. I'm just can't. standing here. I'm saying so you am can't. I. You need to step back. Why are you both you getting in my back. face? Because you're in the private offices. This is not private. There's yes, nothing that says private. Is. There is. This is here for a reason. That doesn't hinder yes, my uh, access back here. Well, you you here. No back. one was at the front desk. You need to step back. Right he here, wants, he wants to walk so around the building. You need to step back. I'm just looking around the public area. You need to go back. You're scaring the staff. You're scaring the staff. Well, I can walk down. I'm not scaring anyone. You're the one telling you they're threatened by you. Move back. You're making me very uncomfortable and unsafe. And That's if you stay I here, I'm going to have you arrested. Deranged. She's asking no. you to leave on your own. I don't have to leave. I'm not breaking the law. She's asking you to leave. I'm not breaking the law. And you won't. You're asking you're me to leave a public space, and, and minutes, I'm not breaking the law. In a few minutes, when we press charges, you're going to see that we were right. For what? Step back. You're deranged. Step back. I'm not moving anywhere. I'm waiting Step right back. here until the this police get not, here. And that's a public area. This is this not. This is also a public and if I area. I leave my, the whole building, you're going to do that too. I don't. You're not Did the you boss of me. I you hope. Call the cops. Yeah, you're scaring her. She's, I'm not, I'm she's just, telling you she is. I'm here. She's t the girls are telling you that you're. She barked at me. The girls are telling you that they feel threatened. But you're not in charge of me. The There's nothing that stops you. That you need to put a threatened. door here or something to stop people from walking are... back here. Hold this, Roy. Roy, hold that, Roy. Roy, what's your name? Roy, what do you do here? 
No, you can't move. Well, now I can go this way. Listen. Don't See, this is to range. Don't mess with it. Well, either you have, to, you have to do that. The girls are look, nervous. Go look, back. Listen to me. Stop yelling and calm the fuck down. Don't if, tell me no, what. No. Watch you like. Stop, listen, stop. just back up. No. Back up. I'm behind your little back barricade up. now. Yeah, I'm gonna keep moving. Stop. Getting, why do you keep getting back in my up. face? The girls don't why want you back here. Else's face? I, my face. I'm not in anyone's face. You're deranged. You all came out here and started yelling at me not to go back here. There's nothing that says I came back here. Who the hell are you all to tell me I can't go in a public building? This is, this, that's a public area. When we allow you in there, this is not. These are private offices, government offices. Go back. I'm okay. back. I'm behind back your barricade now. Back to the front area. No, I'm going to wait here until the police barricades. get here. These the barricades were not were in the way. These barricades were there. They're not in the way. They were in this to the side. That's like any other barricade. You can walk around any, but the way you decide to get on or whatever. You, you need to put make, a sign on the... You, you need to get back. I am the sign. There was no one at the front I desk when I walked in here. So you wait there. You're all to So you wait there. What are you doing? So you wait there. Like a normal Stop touching me. Way. Why are you putting your hands on me? Okay, she didn't put her hands she on She just you touched me. She told you she's afraid of you. Well, she she's so afraid, afraid of me, she put her hands on me. Oh, my God, you're all deranged. You're deranged. You're deranged. All of you are deranged. Rich, superintendent of Whatchamawatsit? Deranged. You're deranged. Roy's doing a good job. Roy's at least keeping his mouth shut. He knows better. Thank you, Roy. I came here to conduct the business. Girls are afraid of you. Go I don't know why. I'm just Get walking around. I'm not Leave doing the anything. Building. The girls I, are threatened by you. Leave I'm not the threatening anyone. I they walked in here calmly. They feel threatened by you. They asked you to go back. You didn't. And now they feel threatened by you. Go back. You're crazy. Go back. Rich, you're crazy. Go back. I went back already. Go back. If you're going to keep no, dropping this thing on my foot. Get out, of the, get out of the building. Get out of the building. Get out of the building. On what lawful out grounds are you building. kicking me out of the building? The girls are threatened by you. I'm not threatening anyone. Listen, I'm not doing anything for threatening. Trouble, no, you I'm not. You've got better to do. You come in here a few times a week. Start with This is only the this. third time I've ever been here, you crazy fuck. No, watch your language. I can say whatever I want. Don't tell me to watch my mouth. Go back. I already backed up, Go Rich. Go back. I'm back. Unless you're going to do something. I'm not doing anything. Life. No. Unless you're going to do something. You're crazy. You're the, the one who's gotten the in my face. By you. Whose doing? cell phone? Is that his cell phone? Is that a business cell phone? Because I'm going to take that camera footage. I'll go answer the phone if they call. Excuse me. You're all crazy. There's no signs that say I can't walk around yeah. back here. You're standing there and intimidating these girls. I'm not doing crazy anything of the sort. You're crazy. You just come marching through, walk through the office. Be because it's a public building. I'm minding my so own business, security. walking around. Go walk around that building. I so will. The FBI office. Go walk through that building. I will. And if any place I'm not allowed to go, they'll have a sign posted or a doorway that's locked. I am your sign. You're not I a sign. Your sign. You're Get an out. idiot. Get out. You're an idiot. Go back to work, Rich. Watch, watch, because I'll have you arrested. For what? Go back. I backed up already. Listen, get out of the building. The girls are threatened by you, and you won't leave. Get out of the building. I have done nothing threatening, intimidating. I just walked to look around. You're in her face. You keep walking around the building. You can't do that. She came out of her office and started yelling at me. she's threatened by you, and she's afraid of you. Go back. What's up, guys? I just came to... Do some paper, file some paperwork and look around the building, and they're screaming at me to get out and back up. And what, what business do you have past the entrance right there? What business at all? Do you I have came to look around the building. What business do you have? I have business in here. I was going to look at the offices and see who I had to what, file paperwork with. What business do you have? It's none of your business. I'm conducting business here. Well, to go in the back, you must have an office or someone to speak. Well, I was going to look around and see where I needed to go. You don't. I have no idea who I need to speak to. Go to the front clerk and you ask him what you need. Well, there was no one there room. when I walked in. So there's a gate here, right? They just put that up no. like three no. seconds no. ago. Okay. This was here on the so side. At this point, what do you need? I guess I need to talk to the lady at the front desk. And go to the front and ask her. Roger, Roger. Thank you, guys. I'm going to. Okay. You guys, okay. Hello. So I need to know how to do a, uh, if I need to request a, uh, a list of all the Village of Greatnick Plaza employees' uh, names, salaries, job titles, their dates of employment. I basically need employee, all the employee records for the town. Thank you very much.
I don't want to do it online. You guys always tell me to go online. I also needed to speak with Pat about a complaint I filed, but Pat's going to be behave in a deranged well, manner. <laughs> that sign was over there, and right. no one was here How when I walked in. Here? What? Okay. How do I know? Because I have a memory? This is what I've been dealing with since I walked in here, is hostilities and anything. And I'm pretty sure it's just because I have this out. Okay. That's fine. That's not fine. Just, just look, you got cameras on. Are those on? Those are on. Beautiful. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. Okay, more waiting. That was like that before. That barricade that's now back where it sort of was. Hey, how are you? What's up, Officer Wana? Good to see you again. Ah, another day in the village of Great Neck Plaza Town Hall. I hear you. What's going on? <laughs> Officer? Altieri. Altieri. Yeah. Badge number? 2164, I'm from the 6th Precinct. 2164, thank you very much. And this is what I need to fill out? Could I? What else do you need? Uh, I also need to get employee complaint I forms. So oh. you fill out what you need. You're asking for it. Yeah, yeah I'm going to fill it out and I'll bring it back. Okay. I also need employee complaint forms for I don't know how I file complaints against the employees, the people that work here, because they literally every time I come here and start to ask questions, they call the police on me. If, if I try to walk, that's a public, publicly accessible area. There's no signage. That barricade's out of the way. I can walk back there. There's nothing illegal about that. I'm not walking into anyone's offices. I'm not trying to go into off-limit spaces. I'm just walking around my town hall. I didn't see where you were walking, but there is a certain point where you do not have access to. Oh, I mean, I'm not going to walk into anyone's office. Well, there if there's a closed door, okay. I'm not going to open a door and just go beyond it. You know in the future, because I'm going to tell you what's probably going to happen. Okay. Right? There's probably going to be a big sign here. Well, there should be. Okay, well, there will be. Okay. <laughs> and at that point now, you're going to be told at this point going forward, this is not access Obviously. to the public. But and if you do step past that certain point, As of now? As of now? It's open to the public. But going forward. They, well, they, they literally again, forcibly put themselves in front of me and hindered. The, the guy, Rich, was yelling and screaming at me and getting in my face aggressively. Threat in this very threatening manner, and then screaming that I'm intimidating him and them. Because you know what, maybe it was. I also a little loud and boisterous. Well, they all. Pat came out and started yelling at me to back up. Well, I I have a question. Can I just make copies of this and give you multiple copies, or do you want to give me multiple copies of this? Make copies. All right. I just need to bring you a white copy. You'll stamp it and give it back to me. Awesome, saucer. What's your name again? Sam. Sam. Sam, I am. Sam, I am. Yes, Sam, sir. I am. U.S. Sam. Uncle Sam. Uncle Sam. Just Sam. Okay, Sam. <laughs> Sam, do you need anything else right now? I don't think so. Okay. So then we're going to go about the rest of our day? Yeah. I mean, I don't know why you, you guys, I don't need help from the police. I need help from them. I'm not behaving around. They're, they're the ones screaming yelling at me. I can't walk around a public building. Mm-hmm. I want to, I'm going to, I'm going to, while you guys are here, I want to go walk in the back of the public building. Sam, at this point, what else do you need? What do you want? I need to, I want to walk around my building and look at the, look in the office windows that are open and walk around the building. Anything that's open to the public, I want to go look at. I was just going to go walk around and take a look. I wasn't going to go in anyone's offices or bother anyone. I was going to walk around, look at the walls, look in the windows that are open. What would be the reasoning that you want to walk around them? Because I can. I'm, decem- I'm coming here to get this stuff, and this is the way they treat me every time I come here. They're hostile. They threaten me. They call the police. They want to have me arrested. It's deranged. I'm just walking around a building looking at the walls, and they're screaming at me, get out, get back. You're scaring us. Like, how- I'm just standing here like, like this, no, minding my own business. Am I scaring you? You got to understand, you know, that's, that's offices there, so it's really kind of a... Well, then they can close, if they're doing, they can close the blinds. I'm not trying to like, you know, I'm just minding my own business, walking around. Like, I'm not like trying to, you know, like, I'm just walking around the public building, minding my own business. And then I've got people coming and, you can't be here. Stop. And getting in my face, like physically, like 
as close as my hand is to you, this man and Pat are standing next to me. Pat's saying she's scared of me. She walks past me and gently touches me on the arm. You know, and she's terrified of me right here. She walks past me and puts her hand, she walks past me, she puts her hands on, on both of my arms when I'm standing here like this with my camera up. She got my hand on my arm. She's so scared of me. She's going to make physical contact with someone who's, like, it's deranged. They're making stuff up. They just don't want me to walk around well, the building. You understand. The way you're right now talking, you sound like you're allergic. You're kind of screaming a little. Well, I'm very it's upset. It's this is the third it's time it's their employees it's have called the police on me. The way I'm talking, you're right well, now I was. Screaming. I'm not screaming. I was talking so very calmly before. Your, your, well, also, I'm hard of hearing, so I speak very loudly and very clearly, so I can hear myself speak, and so other people can hear me. Because I'm hard of hearing. So and now, hearing. yeah, I'm, I'm slightly hard of hearing. I speak very loudly and clearly, and now I'm like, I'm upset, because this is the third time they've called the police on me for just coming around with the camera out asking questions. I asked one of their code enforcement officers up by the train station for help with a ticket. What's this ticket for? Oh, you turn the camera off, I'll help you. No, I'm not turning it off, then I can't help you. Okay, bye then. And then he starts screaming at me. I'm like, you know, leave me alone, fuck off. And he, then he calls here, tells him I'm being violent and calls 911 and tells you guys I'm being violent when I'm just yelling at him to fuck off and leave me alone. And then follows me from the train station parking lot across the street, right? And then down the sidewalk, past the bodega, in front of that little uh, shop and the smoke shop and the, the smoothie store. He follows me all the way down to there. Follows me down the street. I'm walking away from him. Like, yo, leave me alone. Go away. And he's following me. And he's always like, there's a man here being violent. Like, me yelling at you because you're being an asshole, right, is not me being violent at all. Uh, I mean, some people take it as you being violent. I mean. Violence is action. Violence is a physical act. I understand that. But a lot of people don't know that. A lot of people think that when you start reaching to a point where you're screaming a lot, can you get violent? It's a stepping stone. Well. You understand? Put so, it. When, if I'm coming in all nice and calm, do they think that I'm going to be violent? Well, I literally just Dude, walked I'm in just here. I'm just asking you a question. If of course I come not. In, if I come in nice of and of course not. I just need this paper for this. And do, do, do you think that they would consist that I would be violent? No, but now, I literally I in walked in here. Stream, and do you think that that's not what I did. I literally walked in here calmly. No one was at the desk. And I just walked down here. I literally made it up to that. I, I, was, I got two feet onto the carpet. And... This woman said, can I help you? You can't go back there. And I'm like, what do you mean I can't go back here? Like, okay, what do you well, mean well, I can't go back there? The woman was here to ask you help, then why would you need to go back here? Well, I don't need the you. building department's help. I want to see yeah, what's sure going on in the help. building. You said you were asking for help. Is that where he's saying they were when I walked in? Because <laughs> if that's the case, I just. I'm upset about the way I've been treated ever since I moved into this town. I've come in. The first time I asked a government employee for help, he called the police and said I was being violent when he refused to help me because I had my camera out because I wanted to see how he react. He'd behave. All right. So what? What did you? What was, what was the issue today? I I came in here to get some paperwork and look around and, and just mind my own business. Really, I was gonna look around, no one was here to help me. I was gonna take a walk around the building, like that way and that way. I don't, I'm just looking around. No, no, because at some point- There's offices back there, I might need help from a specific person in a specific office. So there was no secretary here. Maybe I could speak with, I need to speak with her, I filed a, an oral complaint with her about the, the employee who first called the police. I mean, I need to see if she did anything about that, which I doubt it. Okay. Well, but, I mean, so if we get her up here to help you, would that be okay? Yeah. I, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. This well, is... Well, I'm trying to figure out what we can do to help you today, you know? I, but the fact that I need four police officers to come and help me again just deal with a town is ridiculous. I had your sergeant yesterday was going back and forth and back and forth because the woman up here refused to help me because she didn't want to be on camera. Okay, but then didn't say a word when three police officers walked back there with cameras. Up. Like, it's deranged. This thing yeah. scares the crap out of people. Sure, Officer D. Filippi. Thank you, Officer. So, I, I just want you to kind of take it from this perspective. Sure. You walk into a facility, they're not normally getting recorded by every person they walk in that they see every single day. Uh -huh. As for us, this is required by our police department. So, other Thank people understand God. our interactions with the public mm -hmm. that we're doing our job correctly as we are today. Yes, sir. Now, most of the day, people aren't walking in and recording her daily business that she's conducting. 
People trust her. They understand her. So when you come in, sometimes it raises somebody's level of suspicion. What is he trying to prove recording me to? Do you, do you, do you understand? Though? Imagine, imagine I just walked up to you on the street with a video cam. Can you let me, let me finish? Go ahead. If I walked up to you on the street with a video cam, sorry to ask you questions, how mm -hmm. would you feel? As opposed to if I just walked up without a camera. I can walk away. Unfo I, unfortunately, this, she can't walk away. I can't well, walk away from you. That's she came out of her office and screamed at me to back up. She doesn't expect to be recorded. I show up to work understanding I might be recorded by someone. I'm fine with that. Unfortunately, she's not. So you, have, you just have to see where they're coming from. It's perspective. You understand? I'll give you one further. You being a male and her being a female, I would say that's probably a little creepy in a way if I didn't know that person whatsoever, that an unknown male now is videotaping me and I'm a female. We're in, okay. we're in public. There's no expectation of privacy. So you would have no problem with uh, your mom or your sister or your daughter. If they're in video, public, being video there's no together. expectation of privacy. So, so if a male walked up to them to start recording them, you wouldn't do, you, it wouldn't bother you? Uh, there's not much I can do about it. It's legal in public. Well, would, it make, would you make you feel frustrated? What, it, 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 it's not I might ask, hey, what, do, what are you doing? It's, exactly. So... But it's different to ask me what am I doing than to physically hinder my movement and then stomp my feet with the ends of that thing, literally dropping them on my toes to get me to back up, also, pushing them into me, Sam, forcing me back Sam, physically, daily, by the way. Basis, how many people do you think go back there to try to speak with them rather than going through the secretary? I don't know. Yeah, Probably a few seriously. dozen. They get delivery. Well, some FedEx guy walks, yeah, whatever. Deliveries. Are you a delivery man? Maybe. You're not a delivery man. May maybe. Or are you a delivery? Yes or no question. Are you a delivery man? I'm here. I'm here conducting that? lawful business, okay. and now I'm being questioned oh, by the police. You are, you are lawful I, they refuse me service, and then they barely you provide have, me you service. You have to understand, on a daily basis, she doesn't have people coming with cameras recording her. So it made her uncomfortable. Shh. Probably, it's normal. People get uncomfortable. Feelings do not dictate reality. She's feelings. I. Listen, we're all human. We all have emotions. People. Your emotions do not dictate reality. I feel no. That's not reality. How do you feel right now? I'm. How do you upset? Feel? You're upset. So you have feelings, right? Yeah, so but, she but has feelings well, I'm upset them. because. So you, you can't say feelings don't dictate reality. No, you just well, said no. you have feelings and you're upset right now. Oh my god. That's so, so a little yeah. hypocritical, Sam. Here's where we're at. So basically, last time we were here, they told you you can't be past that road, and then you tried to go back there again. Today. Because you say something doesn't make it true. No, so, so, I can put a sign. No police officers allowed. Like no, well, it's not. Legally, you can't do that. So, Sam, no, but Sam, you can. You can do whatever you want. You can make a sign that says whatever you want. That barricade means nothing. Here's why that back room I'm is, not harassing her. Hey, listen to me. I'm conducting lawful business in a building. I'm trying to explain to you. So the, here's the reason why that back room is off limits. Because those are offices back there with people's personal information. Okay. That can't be filmed. That has to be FOIL requested. So you can't be back there to see... What well, then there needs to be a sign or something. That, that rope? That rope was not positioned like that. It and was I was fine. physically... Pushed back by Pat and Rich. And they're lawfully allowed to do that. No, they're not. They're not if allowed to put a, their hands in. public place, yes, they can. No, no yeah, you can't. You're can sensitive information, Sam. Uh, right. It if doesn't you, matter. The, expect, the onus is on them to conceal it, not on me. Exactly. Okay? The there. And they also... You guys are... They also verbalized it. Raging. And they can tell So, I'm just dealing with... But they're more than happy to help you up here. No, they're not. Yeah, we're, well, that's why we're here today, so we can get you out of here. I want to go look around my town hall and conduct lawful that's business in my town hall. hall. Is that is the hall. town hall. There's no signage that restricts me from going back there. That's There's true. nothing that restricts me from going back there. What else you need I'm not going to go in anyone. They can lock all the doors if they want to before I walk around, but I want to walk around the building. Let them lock all the doors if they have to. That's ridiculous, but that, I'm lawfully allowed back there. That's, that's public. That's public. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, Okay, Officer Wana. Okay. Okay. So you're telling me. So do you need anything else today? Not from you guys. Absolutely not. You guys can go about your day. Uh, I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do about all this nonsense because this is raising incompetence across the board. So have a nice day, guys. You guys are gonna stand and watch me fill out paperwork? That's a definitely a waste of resources.
This is ridiculous. You guys just gonna, what are you guys waiting for? You said it's public, public place. <laughs> <laughs> you yeah, babysit me? No, I'm just here standing. I'm just here. All right. It's a waste of your time. There's way more important things for you to do. Attention. Check in up the front is. Yes, first. Please be sure to Amateur hour. Make a sign right now, I guess, right? I told them, I, I was here last week on Wednesday and we had the same discussion, right? If I can't go back there, there needs to be a sign clearly there that says I can't go back there. So I want to go back there before they put up the fucking bullshit sign that says I can't go back there. Because once you put the sign up, then I can't go back there. But there's no fucking sign there now, so I can go back there. Legally. Legally, I can go back there. Lock all the doors. Before I leave, I want to go back there. And what are you going to do if they physically put their hands on me and stop me? Or put up the bullshit barricade, in, which is now in, now in the way. You guys, you guys don't see anything wrong with that? Or, any, you know, like they're trying to hide something? Well, they would be hiding public information. I mean, I'm sorry, private information for the general public, yes. That would be what they're hiding. Gotcha. Raging incompetence. <sighs> What a waste of time. So what do I do about this asshole stopping my feet with the fucking barricades, dropping it on my toes multiple times? Huh? Why'd you do that? Why'd you do what? You're raging incompetent, you know that, right? You're incompetent. I can say what I want to him. He's a public employee. How would you feel if somebody told you you were competent? Incompetent? Yeah, how would you feel? Oh, glad you think that. You're an idiot for thinking it, but okay, good for you. I'm not. I know better. 
I know he's an idiot because the way he behaved in the hallway, yelling at me and pushing me and putting the fucking barricades on my toes. You guys love to let people assault other people. You let civil, civil employees assault people all the time and don't do anything about it. People, people spit in people's faces. Don't do anything about it. Have it on camera. People spit on us all the time. Yeah, and you arrest them. You arrest them. I had it on camera, a woman spitting in my girlfriend's face on our front patio. Police did nothing. Oh, I, was, I, I couldn't see anything. What was your name? I didn't get your name. Officer Vilches. Officer Vilches. 3607. 3607. Thank you, officer. Sorry I have to waste you guys' time like this. So much better things to do. How many police cars are here? You two definitely came in one because you guys are plain clothes. You, you're alone in the car. Fucking bastard. They, they, they actually still let you do that every once in a while, right? Usually you're two up. Most of the time. No, not NASA. Usually you guys were. Much safer that way. Two sets of, it's always way, like, there's two of you in the car, you guys can get so much more done with two people in the car. But fill, fill, all the, fill all the cars up, get them on the road, it looks better, the presence is out there, and you guys can, you know? Presence is important. Yeah, presence is important, absolutely. I just, this is a waste of your guys' time. This is the third time I've come and asked an employee for help. It's my first time being your fans, all I know is you from tonight. Well. Hopefully we, we won't become friends on this basis, you know. Hopefully we can resolve what you need, and then I have to come tomorrow night to talk to the judge about the ticket because we tried to pay. We tried to pay it online, and I looked online and it said the ticket doesn't exist. So I came in here last Wednesday. Okay, that's understandable. Walked in. I walked in. Was videotaping. The woman literally was like, you videotaping? I'm like, yeah. She's like, I don't know. And she stormed off and didn't say a word. It makes some people uncomfortable. I, uh, well, then you, you're working in the wrong job. Understandable, but a lot of people are still not comfortable with that. 
They, their feelings, their feelings can kick rocks. Their feelings can kick. Their feelings don't matter. I understand that, but what I'm saying is, go home, sit in your room, be scared. We'll just get someone else to actually help you out. So that's what I, I literally said to her as she walked away. I'm like, if you don't want to do it, you can get someone else to help us. And, and she didn't say a word, walked away into the back office, which is all I was going to do is walk around and see whose names are on what office doors and see who works where. Wasn't going to bother anyone. I was going to go in the offices and look around. Just going to walk down the hallway that's open to the public. That's now not open to the public. I guess if there is a sign there now, which is deranged because I told them to do that last Wednesday. So... We're living in the idiocracy now. Boys can be girls. You can do whatever you want. I, I'm a dolphin. You know? <laughs> I'd swim really fast, that's for sure. But yeah. So, yeah. You just need someone to that, right? I don't, see, they're not, they're not doing their fucking would job. You, would you like me to no. look at the person responding? No, I want them to do their fucking no, no, job. I, I will get it to them to come look at it. No, no, no. I want... Please, sir. Thank you. Listen, I've had a rough afternoon. Thank you, Roy. Well, I need it stamped as received. I want a copy back. Thank you. Amateur hour. I told you about that last week, Rich. You mean what? I'm going to close your office. Girls are talking about I'm going to close your office. Oh, that's retarded. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. You're going to let everyone off of work for a guy walking in here just minding his own business? Stan? So what if, he, what if he had come a half an hour from now? I'm handing it to you. Well, I was just having a conversation with him. Okay. It's right here. Thank you. See, this is an unprofessional bullshit that I deal with. Sorry, ma'am. Sorry. That's right. you got me. It's it's amateur hour. Listen, I understand where you're coming from, and I know what you want things to get expedited. No, it's not even a matter of ex but, the expedition. It's a matter of professionalism well, and courtesy right. towards the people who live in this town and pay taxes and pay for everyone's salary I agree with and you. contribute to the good of everyone else living here. And I I just went about my business. No one was here to help me. I just walked back there, and then I'm getting yelled at in three different directions to stop. You can't go back there. Meanwhile, there was no sign. There okay, was nothing. You understand. Fine. Now, now they said just to stop. If they're telling you to stop, it's obviously because you know what. Wait. But what I'm you can't just tell someone to stop. Well, Officer, if you're doing, if you're, if you're, if you're, if you're if going to my house and I have no sign, I'm going to tell you to stop. I'm so, not walking in someone's backyard. What I'm just telling you is, I'm walking in a public I building. I understand there's a public place, and that's understandable. But once they tell you from people that work here, and they tell you stop, you cannot go past this area. Because they have certain documentation that cannot be seen in public. Well, they, it's, it's almost like, do the, you want me to walk around? And then the the onus. Excuse me. I just want to say one thing. You want me to walk around and I see your paperwork has your information, your social security. Now, that, now I, I walk around, especially you with a camera now. Now, how did you get that person's information? How would you feel if I had to Listen, around? Listen, if I didn't have this, they would say that I was threatening and intimidating and being verbally okay, abusive. Meanwhile, all I did was call him a, 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 the F word a, a few times because he was being a fuck. And I, I, like, I can call, I can call you while you're driving. I can flick give you the middle finger. There's nothing you can do about it. There's no problem in insulting me. No, but these people are allowed to stop serving the public because I walked in here with a camera. I can't, I can't determine that. That's, well, listen, this, their office, not this is unprofessional, and this is amateur. I'll be here tomorrow night to speak with the judge about the ticket That's that fine. literally I, I came to ask questions about, and the woman said she couldn't help me, and you speak to the judge. So I'll speak to the judge tomorrow night. Okay, then you speak to the judge, and then uh, he'll handle, he'll expedite your ticket. Whatever. What I don't know. Obviously, since you don't have the ticket, and you don't know what it is, or... I know what it is. It's an expired meter ticket. I'm saying that you don't know the amount or whatever. Well, I know that, the that, amount. That I know be, everything. It, be... it was a twenty dollars ticket that I got when I when I went to do a tow. Okay. I went to do a tow with Sean Fagan right in front of the the what used to be the Stop and Shop parking lot. Right. You know where uh, Planet Fitness is and uh, right. Best Market used to be. So I went to do a tow there. I parked my car on the street. I put a quarter in the meter. It was about five thirty something. I, I stayed there for about half an hour. 40 minutes, I turn and look, I'm, I'm, and there's a ticket on the front of my car. Okay. 
So I tried to pay it online while I was in Florida. It said the ticket didn't exist. And I had until the 17th to pay it or be in court. And I was in Florida till the 17th. So I came in on the 18th. Walked in here. The woman stormed off. Didn't say a word. Didn't say she was doing anything. Just stormed. And then I find out like 10, 15 minutes, she's calling the police. For, for breaking what law? I still haven't broken a law and they keep calling the police on me. Well, we're not saying that you broke, broke a law. We're not, we're not saying that you did. It's just the matter of the event of how you're handling it. If you, like I said, if I come because here Because I'm getting see, accosted by three people. Sir, if I come here and I just go to the desk, I'm not going to walk around and look around. I'm Why? Gonna stay here and it's wait. a public building. And then, I can walk around if I want to. There's nothing against... Okay, but you understand. There's certain areas that you... Okay, I'm not going in anyone's public, office. You I'm not... camera. You have a camera. Like if that. I have yeah. eyeballs and they can see it, I can videotape it. That's the way the world works. Know. I'm not going to argue with that. That's the way the argue. world I'm works. I'm not going to argue with that. It's, when we're in public, there's, that's an indisputable okay. fact. Are you done with uh, expediting what you need to do? I mean, I guess so. They turned all the lights off and everyone's disappeared. Yes, I understand that because I'm so, here in the dark, so I know. This is embarrassing. Uh, this is shameful behavior on part of public employees. They should all be ashamed of themselves. I have no control over that. Roy did a great job, though. Roy just came in and watched what was going on and held Richie's camera for him for a little while. So, good job, Roy. You're the only one who gets a thumbs up. And him, I don't know his, I've known him for a long time. He did all right. He just kept his mouth shut and watched what was going on. I got, I was getting, Rich started yelling at me to back up, back up. And I'm like, I'm going to stay right here. And he kept getting in my face, like getting in my face. Back up. You're threatening me. Back up. And I'm just like standing there like, um, I've literally just been standing here this whole time. Not, I haven't right. said anything. And now I've got two people. Get back. Get like literally on my toes. And then he, I, I proceed to tell him what the deal is. Like there's no barricade. There's no sign. You can kick rocks. And then he takes the barricade and starts dropping it on my fucking toes to get me back to back up. I want to press, I want to press charges against him for that's assault. And then she put, she put her hands on my arm. That's on, that's on, on, on like, Putting her hands on your arm. Listen, if I did that to her, she would have thrown herself on the floor, screamed bloody murder, and said I threw her to the ground. And that's why, this is the only reason I do this all the time. That's the only reason I, ha I have to do this, because these crazy, dumb fucks want to play games and then make me look like the crazy one when I raise my voice. Thank you, Pat. I'm glad you're having fun. Oh, I hope I'm locked in here. Oh, people are still coming in. Please help this woman. You guys are still open. Oh, should I tell her that you're not helping people? That'd be great. That'd be epic. You refuse someone else's service because I'm here. See, this is why, this is why, this is why I videotape this stuff. Because these people want to behave unprofessionally. You have every right to videotape. I'm not saying you can. It's But they can't behave like this just because I'm videotaping. Understandable. But you couldn't beat me up. You know how many cops beat people up just because just they do this? You know, that's, that's, that's your answer. That's what you want to say. That's fine. Yeah, like, you know? But literally so, just for doing this, you're on a traffic stop, and I walk up on the sidewalk, and I'm minding my own business. So I, I can't say I have a camera myself. So, whatever you so thank you God you have to. cameras. So. And I'm going to need an incident number for this interaction now because I'm going to FOIA request all the body camera footage. I hope all their cameras are on back there. I hope they didn't turn them off. And if they did turn them off... That's a no-no. You don't turn them off till the incident's over. Like I said, I know you. I know your policies. I know your rules. Okay, I used to fine. have. I, I still have lots of friends that are police officers and are ex-police officers. Okay. I I only ever want to work with you guys, not against you guys. I'm I'm all for law and order. I I don't want to break the law. That's fine. So like, they're behaving like like they're acting like I'm, like like I was just gonna walk. I was. Gonna, but then I have people getting in my face, and then they're, stop. And then Rich comes over, and he's like, sir, I'm going to, and then I'm like, no, who the fuck are you? Sir, I'm going to, like, and then he started, and then, what am I supposed to do? You just, no, yes, sir, I'm going to go away. No, I just stood right there. No, right. I'm not going, and he kept getting in my face, trying to physically intimidate me to back up. And he kept dropping those things on my fucking toes. All right, well. It's ridiculous. All right. It's ridiculous. Thank you, officer, for being professional and courteous. No, no I appreciate like I said, it. Listen, I'm, I'm here to make sure maintain the peace for you and for them. Well, this was not very peaceful. I just tried to walk around a public building. That's why.
Okay, but you gotta understand. Listen, I, but I, I understand can, what you're saying, but you gotta also understand. There's a, there's a thing called courtesy of guess what? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna walk into someone's house, kind of a thing. It's not someone's house. But I'm this saying, is a public a building. Well, listen, you're These not are understand. public offices. You're not understanding me? I'm saying it's a courtesy that it's understood you just come to the window and then they're gonna help you. You don't lurk around. I'm not whether, lurking. Whether I'm not. I'm just saying is you don't start. You wait till someone actually helps you. Right. You're there until someone helps. So you. unprofessional. They're, trying, they're just trying to chase me away. Trying to intimidate me. That's all they're trying to do. I live in this town. Watch, I'm going to get harassed now by the parking enforcement for parking in the street. You, know, you watch and see. Thank God I got cameras everywhere. That's the only thing I can do is put cameras everywhere. But they don't like it. I don't know why. They, every, every time I've talked to one of their employees, they literally call the police within... 30 seconds of me showing up being like, hey, what's going on? It's you again. Call the police. Uh, what? <laughs> uh, I don't understand. It's also it's maybe how you come in as well, maybe. I, you, you come every in time I come in, in, no, I come in. What, you, what, I'm going to get all this camera footage. It's on my FOIA request. I'm asking, but I'm just and, saying is, did, did you come here? If I came in here disturbing, if I came in here disturbing the peace, like that'd be disturbing the peace. If I came in here shouting like a crazy person. Fucking <laughs> You know, like, which I could, legally, I could do that outside. Like, if, if I had like a sign, like, signs, signs, like if I came in here and started screaming at the top of my lungs for no reason, that's disorderly conduct, breaking the peace, certain peace. That, you know, that, that you could stick me with pretty, pretty easily. But I literally came in here quietly, right? There was no, that sign was in the corner over there. No one was at the desk. Right? I, I looked around, I, 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 I stood here for a second, and then I went that back there. I was literally going to walk back there. Well, back there, someone was gonna say hi. Can we help you? And I was gonna be like, no, I'm gonna, I'll make my way back up front. And I'll ask the receptionist for help in a minute. So you're gonna just walk back there, walk down. If there was a locked, clo a closed door that said do not enter, I wasn't gonna go in it. I wasn't gonna. If there were office windows with someone in it and an open door, I'm not. I'm gonna. I'll, I was gonna lean, maybe lean in and say hi to Pat from the open door. Well, oh. obviously, Bunny Elijah, you know their names. Well, I know Pat because Pat took the first time the okay. the code enforcement officer took my complaint. I came in here with my camera out. And they asked, are you videotaping? Yes. And I gave Pat an oral complaint. And I wanted to speak with her today about what happened. Why did your code enforcement officer call the police on me when I simply asked him a question and then he didn't like, he didn't like the way I spoke back to him after he was being an asshole. And then he called the police on me to try to have me arrested. That's the messed up part. Is he, he calling the police and saying someone's being violent? Then you're, you're going to show up pretty as quickly as you can if someone was really well, being... Yeah, I mean, if we get a call saying someone's violent, we're not going to assume that you're lying or you're not lying. Or no, we're going to show up and find out what's violent. going on. We're going to come here and, and find out what's going on. Obviously, when we see that there is no violence, then yes, right, sir. screaming is one thing, violence is a different thing. Yes, sir. So that's what we're here trying to prove, and we're trying to make sure that everything's all right. On your end, on their end, we just want to make sure that everything's this up to is date of what has to be exceedingly started. unprofessional on their part, and... I've only ever come here professionally quietly try to conduct my business and I've only been railroaded and blockaded from going, walking around in a public building and minding my own business. Literally, literally, like, it, like, like if I tried to get around you, you literally would like, like, literally like, okay, well, maybe they stopped you and said, okay. But so that's, that's, front, that's, on, that's on, that's on, you can't do that. You can't, there are but no positions you just said you look for someone to help, so once you found the help, what but was they, the reason to go back I don't know who they were. I asked them who they were, they didn't want to identify themselves. I'll help you. Why didn't you want to stay with there to help you? What was the need to go back? Well, I didn't. I was. You I wanted. You said you were looking for help. So once you got the help, no, no, no. what was the need to go back? I, there wasn't someone up here to help me. I you said I was going to walk that. around you the building. You said when you walk back here, someone stopped you. So when they were there to help you, what was the reasoning to still go back there? Because, you know, because it's a public building, and I wanted to you look around. You just said you were looking for help. Yeah, did you? Did you not? Yes or no? It's a simple question. Oh, that's what I, yes, that's what I said before. Okay, so, so then once words. there was help for you... They were not being helpful. They were because being you wanted to keep back, I, I also, back there. Well, I, I, what was the reason to keep going back there if there was there someone standing officer, there to help you? It's a public area. Once again. It doesn't matter. I understand it's a public area. You we're said you came here looking for help. When you were here, here to file, you said there was no one here. I came here to file papers. So papers. when you walked back there, I there also, was someone there to help I also you. wanted to walk around the building and look around, which I'm legally allowed to do. I can legally walk around and look around the building if I want to. They put that sign up just to hinder me from doing that. That is illegal. This is not private property. There's no expectation of privacy. This is made up now just for me. And they're going to put a sign up just for me to keep me from going back there. 
Well, like I said, I'm not arguing that case. I'm not arguing I'm, I'm, I'm going to get out of here because you guys are taking... I need an incident number, though. Can you tell me an incident uh, number real quick? That, that would have to be... Uh, All right, I'm going to go stand right, outside. I'm sweating my ass off. What's that? I said, you're going to stand outside and wait? I guess so. I need an incident number. I would have to go to the car, and then right now, I have to wait for the other officers down. Whatever. I'm sweating my ass off. I'm wearing a warm jacket. I was expecting. Well, to be, I, said, I, don't want you to I was literally expecting running. to walk in. I was gonna do this first if someone was here to help me. Then I was gonna walk around the building afterwards, but no one was here to help me. So I was gonna walk around the building first, get the video footage I need of the offices and stuff, then come up here and get help. Because you're arguing with me semantics, like I was gonna get help. No one was here to help me. No, I was, no, I didn't say here. You said when they said anyway. here, there was someone there to help me. So what was the reasoning to continue? If there because was I'm, to help? I'm. Doing something that I need to do in a public building that I'm allowed to walk around in. Okay, well, they were here to help you when you said you needed help and you I didn't need their help at that moment. I, I literally explained to them, I don't need your help right now. I'll come and get your help in a minute. I'm just going to walk around. They're like, no, you can't walk around back here. Like, what? Wait, what? What do you mean I can't? Well, it's I mean, open they, to the they public. They were busy, so if they wanted to help They were not very busy. They were all sitting on. Well, no, one was, no one was here to help me when I walked in. They were not very busy. I just said maybe they were busy. I don't know if they were or not. I'm just saying this. Once you got that help, this is ridiculous. Why do you accept the help. That's what I'm just asking you. This is because, a simple question. Because I, I, decli I declined the help. They came, they came, what do you need? I don't need anything right now. I'm going to go up to the front in a minute. I'm just looking around. All right, well. And we're, then they we're were, gonna go, Okay, we're just going to go know, back and We're going to go in circles. Let's so, stop. <laughs> you're going to answer. I'm going to answer you. You're going to answer your question. I'm going to still answer it. It's going to be the same over and over again. Ridiculous. Of course, the water fountain doesn't work. Ridiculous. They're just taking this far. What are they doing? What are they doing? Trying to have me. How long have I been living here? I moved here a few months ago. Oh, you just recently moved back here. I, I lived here. My, I lived in Great Neck my whole life. I've been in Lake Success my whole life until I was so still from the area. Until my mother passed away, and then I moved Sorry, to okay. moved to Port Washington, then Glen Cove, and back to Great Neck. Hi. I just want to let you know the mayor said to have a seat. He'll be here in ten minutes. Ted. Yeah. Oh boy, Ted Rosen. And he asked if you stay too. I guess. Yeah, I'll hang out. Thank you, Pat. So you know the area. So you, like, grew up here. Right. Grew up with the mayor's son. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is why this is ridiculous. I never knew this. I, I figured everything was on the level, and now I know everything's not on the level. I guess you learn when, uh, once you... Uh, once you get old enough, you learn what's really going on. I'm going to step outside and vape for a second. No problem. Oh, dang. Ridiculous. Let's see how many police cars are here. One. Two. One. And two. Use the bathroom real quick. Sure. All right, stop and restart.